finally, I want to share with you the hadith of the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam about Laylatul Qadr. He says, "Man qama Laylatul Qadr imanan wa ihtisaban, ghufir lahu ma taqaddama min dhambihi." Whoever can stand in the night of Laylatul Qadr, meaning pray. So the best thing you can do in Laylatul Qadr, as a night starts, is pray. Nawafil, nawafil, nawafil. And the best thing you can do is when you're in sajda, just make du'as. Just cry to Allah and make du'as. But then the Prophet didn't just say pray. He gave certain qualities to that prayer. So let me explain those qualities to you. One, imanan. Whoever prayed before Allah out of, out, out of faith, meaning it's not just faithfully, they were driven, they were completely convinced that this prayer is going to be the best thing that's happened to me. They have this confidence and this reliance on Allah in, this, in these prayers like no other. That's one. Then, wahtisaban. Ihtisab means someone who takes full stock of themselves. I'm aware of my sins, I'm aware of my flaws, I'm aware of what I've done, I'm aware of what I'm ashamed of before Allah, and I'm coming before Allah standing in prayer, ashamed and humiliated and completely convinced that Allah will forgive me and bless me and will let, let, let my sins pass. So I'm coming before Allah, humiliated, in tears, in full account of myself, like a confessional prayer. This is a confessional prayer, ihtisaban. If you can pull that off, غُفِرَ لَهُ مَا تَقَدَّمَ مِن ذَنْبِهِ Whatever took place of any kind of embarrassing sin such a person had done, has all been guaranteed to be forgiven. All of it is guaranteed to be forgiven if we can stand before Allah in that kind of prayer tonight. That kind of prayer is harder to do together. That kind of prayer is much easier to do when you're by yourself. This is the time, this is, this is one of those nights where if you're lazy by yourself, of course, come to the masjid, join the jama'ah and, and do that. But this is the night where you just want to just be you and Allah in tears. That's what, it, that's what it needs to be. You stand before Allah, recite the Qur'an, make your du'as before Allah, and become of those that are fortunate enough to have found this, this layla and, and found forgiveness of Allah in it. You know, our, we're fortunate also that our nights are not very long anymore. Not, there's not that much time. Get some rest, pray, get some rest, pray again, get some rest, pray again. But, but do that in these nights. May Allah Azza help all of us find Laylatul Qadr. Barakallahu li wa lakum fil Qur'an al-Hakim. Wa nafa'ani wa iyaakum bil ayati wa dhikr al-Hakim. Assalamu alaykum.